In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a project from downloaded file examples, samples, and marketplace content. If you go to learn section, you scroll down, you will see engine feature samples and examples that you can download and learn from. These are full projects that you can open inside the editor and reverse engineer how it was done. So if you pick any of these projects, left click, and you can download them to your computer. Same with marketplace items. When you purchase one of these items, it'll be downloaded to your computer and both either the examples or the marketplace content will be placed inside a library section all the way down here in the vault. And currently I have three vault content examples. Now you can't open these directly once you download them. And what you need to do is you need to create a project from them. This way you will always have a clean downloaded example content file that you'll be able to create projects from and then you can modify that project. And if you ever mess up, you delete that project and simply recreate a new project from the vault section. So let's go ahead and do that right now. I'm going to set up Sun Temple. So let's create a project from it. And here I have to create a name. So for any of the vault content, I simply add Unreal Engine 4. This is just a personal preference. For the folder, this is where the project is going to be created in. The default path, it takes you to the C drive, documents, inside Unreal Projects folder, right here. This is the default location. I personally don't store Unreal Projects in the C drive. I have a different drive that I store all the projects onto. So I'm going to hit Browse and go to E drive. Alex GW OLD projects, Unreal Engine 4, and right inside this folder is where a new project called Unreal Engine 4 Sun Temple is going to be created. So now let's go ahead and hit create. This will copy all of the content and create a project inside my projects area section. And if I open the directory where this project is stored, here I have all of the previous projects and here is the Sun Temple project that we just created. And I still have the default clean installation file of the Sun Temple. All of the vault content that gets downloaded from the Learn section and the Marketplace is placed inside Launcher folder inside C Drive, Program Files, Epic Games, Launcher, Vault Cache, and here are the three vault content examples that you see here on the bottom. And if this vault cache folder gets way too big with too many downloaded example files and marketplace items, you can back these up and store them somewhere else and delete them from the vault cache. There is one more thing I wanted to mention. So this section was added into the video. When you download anything else other than a project file content, so things like static meshes, audio, materials or textures, any assets from the learn section or the marketplace. You won't be asked to create a project from them, but you'll be asked which project do you want to add those assets into. So here I have open world demo collection and instead of create project, it is asking me which project do I want to add this into. So simply left click, choose a project that you want to add into and then simply add to project and those assets will appear inside that project and you'll be able to get access to them through the content browser. So I hope this tutorial was helpful on how to create projects from learned section examples and marketplace content.